desire. Um, I have in three bundles and one frontal. I have in a 16 inch frontal, an 18 inch bundle, 20 and a 22. First you're gonna need some bleaching powder along with some developer. I use a dirty volume but would recommend using a 40. Also you're gonna need some hair dyes. I use three bottles of French Cognac and one bottle of Cajun Spice. Some aluminum foil and some hair brushes and combs. Second thing I did was mix the bleach and the developer. I didn't measure it because I knew that I didn't want it to be too thick or too runny. So basically I just eyed it. I continued doing this until I realized, oh shit, I forgot to wear my gloves. Yeah guys, make sure you wear gloves when you're doing this because these things will burn your hands. I continued mixing the bleach until I got the consistency that I wanted. As you can see, it's not too droopy nor is it too pasty. Then I went ahead and detangled the hair first with my fingers then with the brush. When doing this, make sure that you start at the ends of the hair before going onto the root because you don't, you're going to get a lot of shedding. And then went on to bleach the hair. I applied the bleach on the hair starting at the roots but you can definitely start at the tips. Um, but whatever you do just make sure that you go in one direction so that you do not tangle the hair I did this and as I was doing it I was brushing the hair and allows the hair to process if you're bleaching hair definitely make sure that you place your hair in the aluminum foil and make sure that you cover all aspects of the hair after about 15 to 20 minutes, I looked at the progress. Next was the fun part, the part we've all been waiting for, coloring. But before I added any color onto the frontal, I added some Vaseline onto the lace just to protect it from any staining that may have occurred while I was coloring it. So if I accidentally apply color onto the lace, um, it will be protected and once I wash it out, the lace will still be good and won't be stained. In a plastic bag for it to process. In total, I left the dye on for about 3-4 to four hours on both the frontal and the bundles. I know sometimes people like to leave it overnight, but your girl couldn't wait. I was way too excited to see the color outcome. And so, I didn't leave it. It looked a little too unrealistic and unnatural to me. So, I went ahead and bought a dark brown dye color to apply it on. 